new day. Oh my. <gasps> this is the best thing ever. What? Okay, y'all. It's a new day. It's a new unboxing. <laughs> And today is particularly exciting because I finally got in something from Mrs. Vintage, who I have been stalking forever. I love her stuff. I finally picked something up from her and shipping was so fast. Oh my gosh. I am like utterly impressed with her customer service and just overall in general, like experience, buying, discussing, hands down one of the best ones I've ever worked with as far as Instagram stores. So let's get into it yay okay so if you don't know mrs vintage uh primarily does chanel vintage chanel jackets and she also has several other things on her website but she's like an expert in vintage chanel jackets and she just hunts for them all the time she finds all of just like the golden pieces make sure that they're you know all sellable and everything anyway she's such a great reseller like i would highly highly recommend her anyways I saw something that I totally wanted and then I realized that it wasn't black and it was navy blue and I love navy blue but I was just kind of on the hunt for something black which there's a hint what do you guys think it is boop, 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 hee, hee. anyways so when I realized that I said oh shoot I'm just now realizing because the, the the photo with the tent on my phone look, made it look black it wasn't her fault it was totally mine she had stated it and everything but just with the tint on my phone it made it seem a little bit darker anyways when I when I text her or messed her on Instagram and I was like oh I thought this was actually black I can't believe I made that mistake I'm actually looking for something black would you mind if I switch it and she was like yeah totally absolutely no problem I mean she had already packaged up the other one for me and everything like how incredible is that I just really appreciate customer service like that I'm just making sure that I was getting something that I really wanted I'm definitely going to be back for sure and find other gems that I need in my closet. But for now, this piece, when I saw it, I was like, oh my gosh, I need it. That I would get an insane amount of wear out of. And I'm all about cost per wear. If you don't know, if you're new, I love buying luxury, but I only buy something that I'm going to be able to get my money back out of later on and get my cost per wear out of while I do use it. And if I don't uh, sell it on, like I know something I'm going to just wear forever, I'm never going to sell it on. Still, that is the number one rule. I have to be able to get my money back out of it. Okay, so without further ado, let's open it up. Look at the great packaging. Oh my gosh, I really appreciate great packaging. Thank you so much, Mrs. Vintage, for packaging up well for me. <gasps> Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, let's get it out. Let's get it out. Wow, this is heavy. Oh, I'm so excited right now. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> Everyone's like, what is that? I'll give you a hint. It's not a classic jacket. It's not a tweed jacket, which... I will probably end up going back and getting from her. The one that I was originally going to get was a navy blue, that navy blue suit. And I loved it, but I was just thinking, ah, uh, I mean, look at, I have black so much, right? So many of my bags are missing. <laughs> They're all downstairs or the stuff's in them or whatever. But that's the only navy blue one that I have. And I just thought, uh, like, you know, it's just limited. I might need to end up getting a navy blue Lady Dior because I saw... I believe it's in CL. I always get the orientation of those letters mixed up when I say her name. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh. But anyway, she has a navy blue one and I was like, oh my God, she made me fall in love with it. She's like, I, I get so influenced by everything that she, she posts on her Instagram. She's amazing. Anyways, I saw this in black and I was just like, I wear this kind of thing all of the time. I know you guys are like, shut up, just open it. Okay, let's do it. Oh, oh, she wrote a note. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. So sweet. I'm going to I'm going to take a second afterwards and decipher all of that. That's so cute. All right. Oh my gosh, the feel of it. Oh my gosh. I don't know why I did not think this was gonna be wool. I'm sure she stated that, honestly. Like, I, I just did not even really look at the listing. Once I saw it, I was like, okay, done. That's what I want. It looks insanely pretty. 
but I just thought it was going to be like a, a, just a different fabric. This is so pretty in person. Ah, okay. Okay. I'm sorry. Oh my God. I'm going to open it. Oh my God. This is a Chanel black wool coat, like an overcoat. This is so pretty. Oh my gosh. Look at the buttons. The buttons are so like weighty. Wow. Vintage is so much better than new. <laughs> I buy new all the time and I buy vintage a lot, but like, like officially vintage is so much better than new. <laughs> it really is like, wow. Wow. Oh my gosh. Let's open it up. Oh my God. I'm unbuttoning it. They even have the number on the back. So many vintage buttons. This is so rare to have this actual serial number as well as the uh, Chanel plate. These are so nice. This is insanely great. This is better than the photos. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna open it. So keep in mind also, cause on film I'm noticing that this is looking like a lot lighter. This is very dark in person. This is like a pure black, like a very classy, deep, expensive black wool is what it looks like in person. So like all these little lighter areas or whatever, like a fuzz or something, that does not show up in person. <laughs> it's just because I have studio lighting in here. So, you know, really brightens up uh, blacks and makes things show up like that. Wow. Oh my gosh. This is think like a very expensive uh, black wool where you see it in person and you're just like it's striking that's what this looks like so I'm opening it up and look it even has a button up the collar so you can button it all the way up you know because this kind of goes up but what I love is I can take the same side and button it there and the same thing here like this and make it just kind of open a little bit so it has like that effect down the body, if that makes sense. I love that I can style it like that. Wow. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much, Mrs. Vintage. You are the best. We have pockets. Let's check out the back. I know there was a button on the back as well, I'm pretty sure. Okay, no button on the back, actually. That must have just been me making it up. Wow. Still, though, this is such a great length, too. It's like a three-quarter length, but since I'm so short, it'll probably hit a little lower on me and be a bit more full length, which I actually love. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be back. If you guys haven't checked her out yet, guys, go check her out. Go look at her amazing website. She's amazing. Wow. Yep. Such, such a great purchase. Like, hands down, one of the best purchases I think I've ever bought. I'm not even saying that lightly. This is amazing. Oh my gosh, I forgot to mention one more thing. The lining. Can you see? All of the CCs and the lining, which is on all of Chanel stuff, even the new stuff now. But like, it's just so nice. Wow. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, please like this video, subscribe, and click the bell so you're notified because I upload new unboxing videos every single day.